Hey you guys, I'm Nick, aka okay, the only Nick's Games. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to install Zan's minimap in Minecraft 1.7.10. First off, you want to go here, which is Minecraft 1.7.10. It doesn't matter because it's the first thing in the description. Go down there, click that, it'll take you to this page, which is for Light Loader. You want to scroll down until you see Light Loader Installer for Minecraft 1.7.10 right here, and you want to click Download EXE. Click that, it will then download the file. Now we need to go over here to this Link 6 minecraft.net slash it doesn't matter again. It's the second link in the description this time Go down there click that scroll down until you see download Zan's minimap for 1.7.10 right here So download Zan's, Zan's minimap mod for minecraft for 1.7.10 right here click this It will then take us off to a nifty little site called mega.co.nz Click download and then it might take a second to start downloading, but eventually it will so once this is downloaded, and again, I want to stress this, it might take you a second, maybe even upwards of a minute, for this download to even start. When it does, it'll download and we'll be good to go. I'll meet you guys, there you go. I'll meet you guys when it's downloaded. Once everything is downloaded, simply go to your desktop and you will see these two files, Light Loader and a Voxel Minimap here. Now, what, whoa, 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 what if... What if it's not there? What if it doesn't appear? What do we do? No big deal. Simply hit the Windows key on your keyboard and R at the exact same time and type in Downloads. Hit enter and boom, they'll be right here. You can leave them there or drag them to your desktop. Doesn't matter. Nevertheless, go ahead and double click on Light Loader and it will then just open up this nifty little program. Go ahead and click Run. It's fine. And it'll open up this nifty little program. Click Install Light Loader and then click OK. It'll go through. Boom! Successfully installed. Awesome. Go ahead and click OK. And now now we can delete it because we don't need it anymore. Now what we can do is hit the Windows key on our keyboard and R at the exact same time. We're not typing in downloads this time, we're typing in percent %APPDATA, percent, and then hitting enter. It will then take us to here. We want to go into dot Minecraft, and then we want to go into mods. Now as you can see I do have mods in there. You won't have anything in there, but wait! What if I don't have a mods folder at all? Oh no, it's it's over. You gotta restart. No, I'm kidding. Just right click, new folder, and then type M. Okay, nothing major. M O D S. Enter. Boom. Now you have a mods folder. Double click on that mods folder and then drag this voxel minimap 1.2.1 over into it. Now I do want to say this. Make sure this is dot light mod. As you can see, mine is. If your yours isn't, simply right click on it and rename. And then at the end of it here, just type dot L I T M O D enter. Once you've done that, you're good to go. We can go ahead and launch up Minecraft. I'll meet you guys in the launcher. Once you're in the Minecraft launcher, choosing to play light mod with Voxel Minimap or Zan's Minimap installed is very, very easy. Simply go to the profile you want to play. In my case, that's Dead Buddha. Hit Edit Profile and then click Use Version right here. And then, boom, as you can see, 1.7.10 Light Loader. Click that. Click Save Profile, click Play. Minecraft will now launch up, and you can be sure it is correct because uh, it's going to say all this stuff at the bottom is happening, and uh, it's not normally there. As you can see, there's like a load bar and everything down there. That's all new. What is that? Don't freak out. It's it's Light Mod. It's Light Mod working. So if you see that, you know you've done it right. And uh, I'll go ahead and prove it by showing you the mini map in game as well as all that jazz. I'll meet you guys in the main menu. Okay, so once you've got Alright, so once you're on the main menu, simply go into single player just to test this out and launch up any world you want. For me, that's going to be a creative world, and boom! Yowzers! What is that? That is a message from the creator of Voxel Map and slash Zan's Minimap. It's the same thing. It's the same guy. Voxel Map and Zan's Minimap. It's the same thing. And, uh, yeah, as you can see right up here in the corner, there it is. And uh, all of that jazz. So we have installed a voxel map says Zan's mini map. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give a thumbs up. It really does help me out. I'm Nix Games, and I'm out, guys. Peace. And here's some videos you guys probably want to go check out. On the left is Twitch's new policy when it comes to copyright and how they're handling copyright in content. So go check that video out, especially if you're a Twitch streamer or a Twitch viewer. That will really, really get you informed and help you out. That's what it's designed to do. And the video on the right is Modtastic Episode 1. That is a modded Minecraft Let's Play series I started in Tech It. Tech It Mod Pack is what I am playing. Go check it out. I learn mods. I do awesome stuff and that is episode one so go jump in on the ground floor anyway guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you did, please give a thumbs up it really does help me out i'm nix games and i'm out peace